Hi, welcome back to Storytime Magic. We're glad you're here. I hope you're having a great day. Are you ready for another fun story? Okay, here's the story we're going to be reading, so let's go. The story is called It's Me by Eric Drachman and illustrated by Isabelle de Sancier. Patricia was the most beautiful girl in the world. She had warm brown eyes and curly dark hair, which she loved to brush in the big mirror in her private chambers. She was kind and generous and everyone adored her, all of her people. Today, her name was Princess Vanula Lily. She wore a sparkling royal dress and a tiara covered with priceless shimmering jewels. Her trusted dresser had misplaced her white long princess gloves, so instead she wore her big winter mittens. Princess Fanula Lily made her way down the stairway through the grand hallway and paused in the dining room to gather her composure for her regal entrance. She took a breath, then stepped inside the kitchen where her people were waiting. There was a gasp as she flowed in. Oscar barked and jumped on her. There was a round of applause and appreciation of her grace and beauty. Welcome, Pr Princess Finula Lulu, Uncle Bill began. It's Princess Finula Lily, corrected Princess Finula Lily. Well, what a beautiful princess you are, beamed Mom. Beautiful, agreed Dad. I love your crown. Tiara, corrected the princess. Where's Patricia? asked Uncle Bill. I don't know Patricia. I'm Princess Fanula Lily, and I'm very, very beautiful, and everybody loves me. All of a sudden, Patricia had an idea. Oh, I know, she thought, and dashed upstairs. A few minutes later, the door to the kitchen swung open, and standing there was one scary witch. Who's that? gulped Uncle Bill. I'm scared. It's Patricia, blurted her brother, Danny, in another costume, and the dog licked his face until he giggled. Well, she's about as tall as Patricia, but my niece does not have that big crooked nose or that pointy black hat. Hmm, what's your name, witch? I'm Pa. I'm Putch. Um, Patrushka, the evil witch of um, Mabel Court, and I'm very, very ugly, and everyone's afraid of me. And she laughed a scary laugh to prove it. Don't turn us into toads, begged Dad. Well, you just better be careful, warned Petrushka, because that one I already turned into a doggy. And with a twirl of her cape, she disappeared out the door. Before long, the door swung open again, and standing there was Mom's dress with a little girl inside. Who are you? asked Dad. Don't be silly, dear. I'm the mommy, and this is our baby, Patricia. Isn't she beautiful when she sleeps? Yes, she is, honey, smiled Dad. You're doing such a good job raising her. Yes, Patricia is the smartest, kindest, most beautiful girl in the world. On hearing that, Danny pretended to throw up. Little Mommy turned around and on her way out explained, I have to go write a new book. I'm a very famous writer, you know. A few minutes later, the door swung open again. Wow, gasped um, Uncle Bill. Who's that stylish girl? 
It's me, answered Patricia, and she sat down on the floor to play with Oscar and Danny. Oh, I know, guessed Dad. You're the farmer's daughter, just back from milking the cows. It's me, cor corrected Patricia, standing up again. I know, said Mom. You're the girl from that TV show we love so much. It's me, exclaimed Patricia, getting a little frustrated. I know, said Danny. It's the ghost who keeps stealing my toys. It's me, yelled Patricia, stamping her foot. It's me. It's you, asked Mom. My wonderful daughter? It's me, said Patricia, and she hugged her mom. I missed you. I missed you too, sweetheart, grinned Mom, and she gave Patricia a great big squeeze. I kind of miss that Princess Fula Baloo, teased Danny. Finula Lily, laughed everyone, and they laughed and laughed and laughed. Do you like to play dress up sometimes? That's a lot of fun. That was a great story and it was a lot of fun to read. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to come back tomorrow to hear another great story. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Click the big red button to subscribe.